Hi, I travel with Steve Pettit from 2005 to 2008, and I still remember the first time I got the phone call to see if I was interested in traveling. And I actually had no idea who Steve Pettit was, and I didn't really know much about the team, and I was like, okay, sure, I might be interested in traveling. So I visited the team a couple times before Steve officially asked me to travel, and he didn't really know me, he didn't know my abilities very well. He didn't know what kind of a person I really was, but he still in faith asked me to travel. I have some fun memories from traveling. The first time I realized that Steve Pettit and I were friends, we were at a restaurant together as a team and I couldn't finish my meal. And Steve Pettit looked over at me and he was like, hey, are you gonna finish that? And I was like, no. And he said, pass it on down and he finished my leftovers. And I was like, oh, we are friends. Steve Pettit just finished my meal. And I still remember that as being the time when I was like, okay, yes, we are, we're cool and we're friends and, and this is gonna be fun. Well, thank you, Steve and Terry, for pouring your life into mine, for loving me, for being patient with me, and for accepting me into your family. And I would not be where I am now if it weren't for you and you were the, one of the first ones to call me about the ministry that I'm in now and said that I would really love it down here in Atlanta. And you're right, I do love it here. And I so enjoyed having you around the first year that I lived here. And I'm so thankful that our relationship, even though we still don't see each other as often, it hasn't changed. And I look to you guys as family. Thanks for showing me what it looks like to live for the sake of the gospel, to give your life for something greater than yourself. And truly my life has been changed because of you and my ministry outlook has changed because of you. And um, I just pray that every day God would use my life for the furtherance of the gospel, even as you gave your life for that sake. And so I pray for God's blessing and his grace upon you as you continue to use your lives for his kingdom. And I love you and I thank you so much for all you've done for me. Do what is right.